Good morning guys, so today is December 2nd, as you can tell, and we are going to start off is by making me some coffee, that's just the way I like to start my day, as most people, and then we'll think uh, what we're going to do the rest of the day. I like to add some white chocolate to my coffee. I'm adding about a tablespoon or so, and that's it. I don't add anything else. Um, it just depends on the day. Some days I like to add condensed milk. Sometimes I like to add my um, creamer. And today I just wanted to use my white chocolate. And so for breakfast, I'm having some scrambled eggs and my little sandwiches. They're just the uh, smoked salmon and a little bit of bread with a little bit of mayo, just a tiny bit. And since today is Cyber Monday, I'm doing some shopping for my daughter. I like this website. Um, I just found it on Instagram one day and I just love their clothes and the quality and the fit. Um, and they look really cute. So that's what I'm doing right now. All right, guys, so I just came back from Trader Joe's. I'm gonna share my little haul with you. I just had to grab some couple of things. So we're gonna start off is I got these waffles. I think they're like my favorite from what they have there. These are really yummy. I think these are only come during holiday, but I could be wrong because I've only seen the other three that they um, carry. Then I got this cereal. My kids really like it. I like it. Even my daughter opened it up on her way back from the store. She wanted she wanted to have some. Um, then my next favorite thing is these, you guys. They're so addicting. If you haven't tried them, you guys definitely should try them. They're yummy. Also, some apples. They're the organic pink lady apples. My kids like those as well. Then we got the turkey breast for sandwiches. I got goat milk for my daughter. She only drinks goat milk. Um, then we got sour cream. I'm gonna share another recipe with you guys in a couple of days that I'm gonna be making another another dessert then cheese sticks and some more cheese this is i like to use this one for um what are they called cheese what are they grilled cheese oh my gosh i can't think and then my son's favorite yogurt it's like the smoothie he likes to have that for lunch. And creamer. That's what I like to drink because I can't drink any dairy products. 
Well, I try not to. And then another cat, uh, pack of sour cream. And then these potatoes. The organic red potatoes. They're like the best. We like to eat them. And then my favorite thing I did guys show you guys. The mini carrot cakes. They're very delicious. So that's pretty much it, you guys. And now it's another break for my coffee. Sometimes I have two coffee, coffees a day. And that's what I'm planning to do right now. And then I'm going to have it with my favorite dessert, which is the carrot cakes that I showed you guys from the haul. Again, I'm adding my white chocolate instead of the creamer, but that's just, I think, today has been the day I just been wanting, craving some white chocolate. And I'm telling you guys, if you haven't tried these, you should definitely try them. They're very addicting. Um, they're just super moist and super yummy. My kids like them. I like them. Um, I think they're seasonal as well. I could be wrong, but I don't think I've ever seen them in the summertime, but they are super delicious. As a tradition, my husband always bring me a pinceta, and that is what he did today for me. All right, you guys, so as I promised, I'm going to share my mini haul with you from what I got at Target last time. So, let's get started. Um, the first thing is I picked this up at the dollar spot. It was five dollars and I just thought it was really cool because it's you know the season to be baking and cooking and all that and I thought why not and try something new so five dollars it looks really pretty too you guys and it's very festive so I can also display it and use it as decorations not just uh, for recipes and stuff but yep um, the next thing is this thing you guys already saw it it's the countdown and it was only three dollars you guys yeah very cute and it's just like it moves so you can tell and it's like on this little lander and you can hang it, or you can just you know lean it against the wall or whatever and it has these little the kind of like magnets but I don't know what they really are but and then they just slide over to whatever day it is so we are on day two and then as usual I picked up my favorite boxes they actually they're six dollars they're the sugar paper sugar paper um, brand and like I said last year I still love these they're my favorite for presents they looked they look elegant they're inexpensive and I reuse some of them like if I give my husband a gift obviously it's gonna stay at the in the house so I can put his gift again in the same box and reuse it next year <laughs> and they look really pretty so I picked up two of these one Uh, I think I'm gonna go back and pick up more square ones. I only saw the rectangular ones, um, but I have some of those from last year, and I think I need the square ones because they fit um, bigger stuff um, instead of the rectangular ones. Um, but these are, I just love the way they look under the tree. I also picked up this little thing. It's actually for 
this candle that I have. And it's just gonna go like this. And look, voila. Really fun and festive for the holidays. I can't remember how much this was because I took off the tag from it. And then this car, you guys. Ta-da! I thought it was so cool. I added lights to it. The fairy lights. Ooh. And close them off. The fairy lights. So that's why I don't know if you can see that or not. But there's lights on this tree. I just wrapped it around and I thought adding some light would look really cool. So yes, this car is just it was just I don't know. I just fell in love with it when I saw it. I was like, I have to have it. It's so Christmas like and it was inexpensive. Um this car was like twenty dollars. $19.99, I believe. And I was at Home Goods recently and their sell for like $29.99. So this was a good deal. And then the last thing that I got for Christmas was of course the pajamas. I got us uh, the whole set. So I got this one for my husband. It says pop on it. I don't know if you can see that. See. And so it's like the Papa Bear. I opened up mine because I had to try it on. And this one says Mama Bear. So this is how it looks. Can you guys see it? See, it says Mama Bear. Um, I got mine in size small and it fits really well, even though I usually get like a medium. But um, I think these run a little, a little big. Like these are the pants. I mean, it depends on how like how you like your uh, pajamas to be like more tight or more loose. But um, these were a good size fit for me, I guess. And then I picked up the kids one, so I got this size. This one is for my son. I like their pajamas to go a little bigger because they wash. A lot like I wear I have them wear it through the season I don't wear them just like the day before because I feel like it's useless <laughs> oh and the prices um, this is $14.99 this is the kid size I have size 8 for Alex and he wears size 7 right now 7 8 depends on some things um, and this is medium for my husband and his was more expensive it was $24.99 Mine was uh, $19.99. And then my daughter's, I picked hers up in size 3. And this was the most expensive, uh, least expensive one. This was $11.99. And this is how her hers look. But um, they're for a boy and a girl. So, and this one just says little on it. Like little bear. So mama bear, papa bear, and little bear. So like I said, I like to get my kids uh, more bigger sizes. That way they, sh I know most of the, um, sorry, my kid is crying. <laughs> uh, her daddy's taking care of her. Um, when I wash them, uh, the, a lot of times they shrink. I don't even know what they're made out of, but, um, that's the reason I get them bigger size. So, and this is her pants. The pants are a little big on her because she's in size two, most of her stuff right now. But like I said, her uh, shirt will probably shrink by Christmas. So we are gonna be wearing them pretty much now. Well, the kids are, I don't think we are, but the kids will be wearing them most of the season. And that was it, you guys. That is all that I got for you guys to see. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you liked it. And I hope you guys liked my vlogmas this year. Give this a video a thumbs up and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.